Welcome to Dumpster Diving, where we look at something horrible from the past. Today, Sister Sister. Tia and Tamara are hanging out in their room and they're upset that Lisa is reading their mail. They then look directly to camera and explain that privacy is important to teenage girls, a lesson every father and boy who has ever drilled a peephole has already learned. The girls are talking on the phone together with their friends, which is what social media was before the internet. Their parents walk in and like all parents do with social media, they kill the conversation. Have you seen Facebook recently? It's all political debates and remember when Third Eye Blind was popular posts. Either Tia and Tamara, I can't really tell them apart, tricks their dad into agreeing to let them have their own phone line. Jackie recites the terrible comedy that's been written for her. Collect call for Mr. Ray Campbell. Sucker. The family goes out to the store to buy new phones and come back with enough shit to keep Radio Shack open for 10 more years. Upstairs, the girls record their own phone message. They try their hand at the staple of wacky 90s comedy, the funny message. Yo, yo, this is Tamara and the lookalike Tia. We're not home, so leave a message. This is Forrest Gump. Twins like a box of chocolate. Hi, this is the washing machine. The answer machine can't answer the phone right now. That's not funny. Huh, I guess the show finally became self-aware. Lisa brings in the laundry and notices that there's some messages on the girl's machine. An angel tries to convince her not to listen to the messages, but a devil tries to convince her to do it. Like always in Hollywood, the devil wins and she plays the messages. The first message seems innocent enough. It's the girl's friend telling them to meet them at the library. In the next message, the bomb is dropped, however. They've got the cigarettes. Mom Jackie is beside herself. She's not about that life. The girls are driving around smoking cigarettes, and holy shit, Brittany Murphy is one of their friends. But I guess she was prone to making mistakes. Just ask her pharmacist. Tia and Tamara are starting to have second thoughts about smoking, and they go on a long diatribe about why it's bad for you. It sounds less like teenage dialogue and more like they're just reading from the Surgeon General's pamphlet. The parents search the girls' room looking for evidence of smoking so that they can confront them. However, the girls come home so they end up hiding in the closet. It doesn't take long for Tia and Tamara to find them, making it the most significant time that a black man got caught in the closet until Frank Ocean. The twins are furious and they all argue. Later, Ray is fiddling with his new electronics and the lights go out. They resolve their issues with the audience basically blind, which is good for radio but not so much for television. The lights come up and Jackie says that some things are just easier in the dark, which is a line she stole from all her previous boyfriends. Thanks for watching this episode of Dumpster Diving. Come back next Thursday for another episode. Come back every Monday for Trump Explains Classics and every Tuesday for deleted chapters from famous novels. Don't forget to like, subscribe to this channel, check the description for our social media handles and other websites of interest. Thanks again for watching. See you next time.